Hello, what up guys? How you doing? It is Lasty here. Welcome today to a new episode of the FIFA 20 Ultimate Team Road to Glory. Finger points to the sky for episode number, what is it, 336? Something like that. There is a background today. It's rewards day and you will be seeing my rewards on rewards day. I know how much you love that. And that's the content that I've got for you today. So, with controller in hand, if you will do me a favor right at the start and hit the thumbs up button, I'd greatly appreciate it. We are shooting for 2,123 likes. I don't know why, but just go for that. Uh, and of course, don't forget to subscribe as well if you are new around here. So it should be 9 o'clock. Yes, it is easily 9 o'clock now by the time that I've waffled on through my intro. Let's go and have a little look-see at what we've earned this week. Um, <clears throat> so Rivals, I'm pretty sure, I hope is rank 3 and not rank 4. Uh, yeah, it is. Okay. It's pretty difficult to get rank 4 if you play up to 14 games in the weekend league. Because there's not many people playing in Rivals anymore. Uh, so I'll just take the untradeable packs. To hopefully get as many fodder players as possible. Uh, four mega packs there, which I will absolutely take at this stage. And then for third champions, gold three, OP. We should get ourselves two red player picks. I don't know, I'm kind of feeling a little bit lucky today. When it comes to the red picks, I just got a feeling that we we're going to maybe get something. Something kind of worthwhile. I hope so. Whether or not that actually happens is probably not going to happen. I just, I, there's a little bit about me today which kind of feels like maybe EA are going to throw a bone to those people that are still playing. We shall see. But if you haven't done so already, I need that little extra slice of luck by you hitting the thumbs up button to get to our like target today. Let's get a big red player, shall we? Three, two, one. Boom. Red player pick number one. I will take a Cecenia, you know. That is a super sub of dreams right there. I love this card. I actually really do love this card. This is a sick card. 92 rated to senior. 95 pace. 93 dribbling. 93 shooting. 87 passing. 85 physical. Most importantly, 4 star skill. 5 star weak foot. This is a sick tots player. And I'm actually really happy with that. I will put him on my bench and I'll be looking forward to bringing him on. Um, because that was... This was a blue witch... Sold for quite a lot. I guess he's probably not much now. We could check. Let's ha have a little hop onto Footwiz, shall we? Come on. All right. Cessina. I bet he's well under 100k. He is. 97k. Oh, that might just be as well because that's what the prices of those rated players are. So he's about 100k, which is not like world beating or record breaking or anything, obviously, for a red pick. But... It's a really good one. And I, I just like this guy in game. Clutch, clutch player. So I'll definitely take him. That's a W for me in terms of red so far. Uh, I don't know what you guys think. But I've never managed to get like... Or I guess last week we could have got Alex Teixeira, couldn't we? But we took the higher rating. Any of those Brazilians, I, I always quite like to get them. Because they were... They were what I wanted to use during TOTS. But they were always quite expensive. Anyway, red pick number one was a success. Can we go for a success in red pick number two? Let's try it, shall we? We're going to get 94 Chris Smalling. That right there is a nice high rated player. I will take it. I will take it. That is a main top five league tots. We could get Corona as well. See, I put a little accent on the name so that hopefully I don't get some sort of demonetization for using that word in these times. But he's a very good card as well. We've had this guy before we actually took him in red i think uh, earlier during tots and was planning on using him as a super sub but obviously i'm just going to take rating here 94 rated chris smalling is going to help reduce the price of probably another 80 89 plus double whatever that is just because there's another one of them out um and that right there ladies and gentlemen are my red picks i've got to say one of the better weeks uh, for red picks for me, just because we get a really good fodder player. Actually usable as well if we ever went back to like the Serie A English, we could link him to Joe Gomez. But uh, I imagine he'll be gone before before I uh, ever even got the chance to use him. And I could just go ahead and buy him, couldn't I, in blue if I wanted to. Uh, and Cecenia, who is, yeah, that's uh, I'm going to try and fit him onto my bench this week because I think he's a, a good enough super sub that we'd I'd quite like to bring on, you know. Saying that, I've got Red Atal in my club, which I never end up bringing on. So, <laughs> oh, 
I'm just looking at Twitter. Oh, okay, okay. Just, just seen my mate Marshall pack uh, foot birthday Saint Maximin, uh, which he's a big Newcastle fan, so that's good to have him first owner. Um, right, before we get into the packs, in Foot Central, I have one thing there, which is one Tots pack from the Triple Threat. I've done the squad battle stuff. Um, I need to do the rival stuff. I'm hoping people will be nice to me and let me just get the, the goals and then I don't care what happens for the rest of the game. If I win, lose, we play it out. They they win, get other objectives done. I don't care. But hopefully they let me get that done quick because I'm at 0 out of 5 for that. And then we would have... My controller stopped working again. I tell you what, guys. I did, I did, if this happens during the weekend league, I am going to be angry. I don't know why it does it. Anyway, yeah, hopefully for tomorrow, we'll, eat, we'll have three TOTS packs to open. That might just be pretty much what tomorrow's video is, because it's, it's a struggle for content right now. So if I can open live three TOTS player packs, then maybe that changes something in my team. Uh, that could be quite an interesting video, I think. But it's time for seven packs. Seven packs. Six of them are mega packs. One of them is a 50k pack. So... Hey, man, if we can get one tots from these packs, I'd be buzzing. Or one tots, team of the year, whatever, whatever, you know, like a good special card. But last week, we really struggled to get walkouts or anything. Uh, so I'm hoping that it's not that bad today. But really, I just need fodder for those. There's two other SBCs out, right? There's the 86 plus uh, player pick. And then there's the 89 plus double again. So EA seem to be keep re-releasing re them. Hopefully I can just get stuff that I can put into them because other than that, there's no other really like good SBCs that I'm that bothered about. Um, you know, unless they bring out another Zhao Felix type one or Mason Greenwood type one, uh, but obviously for different players. Uh, but we don't start off particularly well here. We do get a squad fitness, which I'm starting to run fairly low on. Uh, yuck, we'll get rid of that, obviously. Uh, and is he a tradable medal? He's not. Oh, well, it is sad times. But, hey, we move on. And then, was there one more duplicate there? No, nope, there wasn't. Okay, sick. Uh, so, not a great start, but we take a Rudiger. Rudiger is a, a good link player between the Premier League and the Bundesliga. No, nothing again. No boards again from Mega Pack number two. I can tell that this end of things is going to be pretty bad today. I just got that feeling. Oh, Hakimi transferred. I actually had no idea that he now plays for Real Madrid. That's probably a, an expensive card. I know it's untradeable, but again, that's good for links and stuff. I'll take it. I'll take it. But what we really want to see is the 83 to 88 type players that will help us on our rating. Hey, well, let's not even stop at 88. Let's get like 95 rated players. There's a good amount of squad fitnesses there. Uh, discard these. Sorry, Andrew Marks, but... You, I've already got you, mate. Mega pack at number three. Come on, let's get our first. Let's get our first boards. None again. Dudes. What's happening here? What's going on? Why is it only giving me the rubbish players? It seems so difficult to get anything right now. Come on, EA. Those that are still playing the game, just reward them. Let them have whatever they want. Man, this is rough. This is really rough. Two squad fitnesses. An anchor chem style. I'll take that at least. Then is that a tradable buying kit? No. All right. Well, we move. Um, yeah, so far so bad in terms of the actual gold packs. Mega pack number four, the final untradable one, is not going to be a board again. All right. I can't complain. I didn't play a single game of rivals this week. So all of these rivals rewards are simply from getting to the weekend league 14 wins. So should I be able to complain? Absolutely not. But am I going to complain? Sort of. I'm, pi I'm pissed. I, I want something better than that. Come on, man. Come on. It's August. Give me some good cards. Not A lot of them aren't even worth anything anymore. Just let me have them. Give me a team of the year in a pack, please. All right. We're now onto the tradable stuff. These are my weekend league rewards. It was a hard old graph this weekend to get 14 wins. So I'm hoping that that has paid off. It has in the reds, I guess. But in terms of mega packs so far, it's been awful. And we are going to get boards. Thank you, Lord. We are just going to get boards, though. I don't know who this could be. Oh, Hamshik, right? It is an 84. That's all right. It's a difficult league to link, though. Chinese Super League, right? I think. Uh, I didn't even recognize the badge. Oh, there's an 83 in there as well. That's good. Um, 
Yeah, he does play in the Chinese Super League. All right, 84 and 83. That's a lot better. Lots of players in this mega pack as well. Did I open? Yeah, okay. Three squad fitnesses. These don't sell. I'm not going to keep the contracts either, actually, because I've got loads of untradable ones. And that can go... Uh, CM to cam. No, that's not really worth anything. We'll discard, discard, discard. Move on and get 1,100 coins. So we got an 83 and an 84. Now can we get an 85 and an 86? So we get our first walk out of the video. No, we're getting nothing again. Tragic, tragic, tragic. At least the red picks were good in my eyes. Uh, Lucas Vasquez. Okay, so we're really going to struggle here. I'm going to have to use a lot of these players in the 82 to 88 upgrade and so on and so forth try and get some hopefully get some walkouts there that can save our ratings for our sbcs so right now things are looking a little bit dire they're, they're looking a little bit kieran and dire right now um rare players pack it's the final pack of the episode boys i mean <laughs> If this isn't a boards or walkout or anything, then it's been it's been a tragedy in the pack side of it. I've pushed the button and I've put the controller down. It's gonna be at least boards. It's gonna be a blue walkout. I don't know what this this is not a tie. I'm not even getting baited. I'm not getting baited. It is a Verratti though, so I take that. Uh, that's an 86, and it's tradable. Maybe I'll just use that because he's probably one of the cheaper 86s anyway. Um, but yeah, there's no way I was getting baited by that two weeks running. You saw that happen to me last week where I thought that, that blue was the right shade of blue for a team of the year. No chance. Not this week. Um, but yeah, Verratti. There could be another 86 or maybe 85, 84, 83s in here. What we got? Straight down to the 82s, huh? All right. Well, what does an 86 Verratti cut? He's nearly extinct at 37.5k. Weird. <laughs> okay, well... That doesn't fill me with confidence in terms of buying players for some of these SBCs. So I'm obviously going to keep him and just use him, I guess. Uh, some of these 82s will be all right and can be filler players. Other than that, it's been pretty tragic on the pack side of things, as I said. So let me just quickly go through the SBC section to make sure what I thought came out came out. What's this? Gold players pack for a UCL halftime challenge. What does that actually require for a gold players pack with one rare? 75 rated squad and it needs an Atlanta or Paris player. Get lost. Come on. When we used to get like rare players pack, mega pack. Stop stunting these SBCs, man. Come on. It's August. Give us some sick packs. 86 plus upgrade. I like that one. 89 plus double. And didn't they release a team of the week upgrade? So that you can get... Yeah, there we go. What does that actually require? So I'm probably going to have to do one of these to get... It requires an 81 rated squad. That's that's okay. We can get that done. No problem. Uh, 40 chemistry. It will give me the team of the week or whatever that I need to then stick into uh, the 86 plus upgrade. Because that one requires... So like an 84 rated squad, but it needs a special card. Yeah. It's Tots Team of the Week, Team of the Week moments. I don't have any of them right now, I don't think, that I could submit. Like, none of my Tots I'd be willing to put into an 84-rated squad as we come down here. And I don't think I have any Team of the Week players, do I? Like, this is where the special items end. I don't have any informs. I don't think. Unless i got a 75-rated one somewhere. Nah, I don't, do I? This is, uh, yeah, so I'm going to have to do that inform upgrade. I have to. In order to get something for this. Because I'm pretty sure anything under 40 or 50k is extinct. Maybe not now. Because EA have released the Team of the Week SBC. And good for them for doing that. It's just a little bit late. We needed that a couple of days ago. Um, and then this is... Is this 87? Is this actually 87 rated? Oh god. 60 chem. I don't know how we're going to get done that. But uh, Chris Smalling will have to help. Because there's... Uh, maybe what we have to do, right? So the plan should probably be... I end this episode, I go off, I go into Rivals, hopefully I can get those five games with the goals that I need for the players done ASAP, quickly, right, get that done, uh, and then I would have three TOTS packs, and at that point, I fire this camera up again, I record those three TOTS packs, that's tomorrow's episode, and then 
Uh, we've got either, we either get some sick tots, which would be good for the squad, or we get some high rated fodder, we get some low rated tots fodder, whatever it is, and that could go into the uh, 86 plus upgrade pack, because one of them would be a tots, that could help us out. We could get that, hopefully get a tots in that, if it's usable, cool, if it's not, it goes into the 89 plus double, and we use Chris Smalling and stuff in there to... Uh, and that will be the day after's video, these these two packs. That will be like Saturday's episode for you where we, we open up these live, hopefully get something good in them, and then start our weekend league. I think that's pretty much got to be the content plan for the next couple of days, guys, uh, just so you know what's coming up. And then hopefully in the meantime, EA might have released some other cool SBCs, which as we go through the weekend will help me get some new players for the squad or new other cool SBCs to complete. Um... But we're running on fumes. We really are running on fumes. I think this is, at the moment, what the team is going to look like for the weekend league. Uh, but instead of, I don't know, somebody on here like, I don't need I don't need Tete in this squad anymore. Uh, I'll just put a uh, special new Bring Cecenia in, right? Why not, right? I love this card. So we'll do that. And I think I also probably should. Uh, sorry, Promise. But I, I am disrespecting... My man, Atal. So come back in, mate. We'll sort the rating out of that bench in a little bit because that is all over the show right now. Uh, or just My controller stopped working again. I'm just going to put it down. Guys, that is the end of the episode for today. Do me a favor and hit the thumbs up button, all right? 2,123 likes, did I say? Something like that. Just hit the target. And, of course, don't forget to subscribe as well if you're new around here. I know the content is dry right now. I'm doing my best in these late stages of the game to still bring you the daily content. Hope you're still enjoying. And uh, yeah, I mean, like, I love you guys for still tuning in. Thank you so much for that. Uh, follow me on Twitter and Instagram. The links are down below. Have a great day. Take it easy. Stay safe and healthy. You can let me know in the comments what you got in your awards as well. And I will catch you tomorrow for another episode. Peace.